up guys it is your girl tree with another tip from tree tips media okay i got diddy on top um which is probably gonna be coming down in a little while diddy is still locked up he has some good stuff going on i just found out with his case and he also has some bad stuff going on so which one do you guys want first the good or the bad Okay, since you guys want the good first, let's go ahead with the good. The good thing is about his case is I've been saying this. Did he need new attorneys? So I think he still have the same attorney, but he has added to the group. I think he's trying to build this dream team, how OJ did, whatever. Anyway, he added this uh, pellet attorney. She's very good. Her name is Alexandra Shapiro. Look her up, guys. She's a good appellate attorney. Some might say, why do he need an appellate attorney right now? Well, when you go through the trial, you want to be able to find all of those appellate issues that might come up and that might not come up. So in case he gets convicted, which he probably will, um, He'll have chances for an appeal. And an appellate attorney, a good appellate attorney, will come in handy for that. Another team player he's added to his team is Mr. Anthony Rico. Go figure, last name Rico, and this is a Rico case. But Anthony Rico is a high-class defense criminal defense attorney in new york city so this is going to be interesting he's adding on to his team i think that's a good thing because the attorney he has now has been talking way too much to the public and I'm not sure if he don't understand but everything that he's saying can and will be used against diddy in a court of law so let's move on to the bad things now now, the bad thing that's going on with Diddy Case is there are 120 more victims that have signed up for saying that he has either sexually abused them or done some kind of criminal activity to them. Um, they have a new high-class attorney themselves. His name is Tony Busby. He actually did some kind of news interview or whatever but he laid it all out there was like three thousand people that actually contacted him in regards to diddy doing something wrong to them but he only took 120 of them of their cases he said he verified locations he made sure that they were who they say they are he made sure that they was in sean combs presence at the time and dates that he said that they said that they were now he claims that there's going to be more people that's going to be in trouble probably for this civil suit um that he's creating against diddy some of these people he also said has talked to the feds so some of them can be added to the criminal case as well but he's creating this big old civil suit against diddy he said each one will have their own case there won't be a class action lawsuit he said that some of them and this is why i'm really going to be on diddy's head some of these kids some of these people are grown now but they were actually kids when they were sexually abused by Puff Daddy. And this, he said some of these cases stem back all the way to the 90s, guys. So this is this is getting real juicy, Diddy. Real juicy. He said the the um the age the age of the youngest person at the time that they were a sexually abused by Puff Daddy was nine years old he said nine twelve fifteen a lot of these kids was sent to sean combs because they wanted to become stars in the process of wanting to become a star they allegedly said that diddy did some things to them and not only diddy he had co-conspirators he had people that got them there people that watched um allegedly a lot of this is on video so we don't know what all this attorney has this attorney name again is tony busby he was in charge of the bp oil spill um suit that a lot of victims got paid from 
Travis Scott concert. He was the attorney for the victims of that concert when the incident happened. He's an attorney. He has the right to practice in Texas, New York, and I believe Atlanta and Los Angeles. Don't quote me on that. But he did say some of these cases happen in Los Angeles and will be filed in Los Angeles, but the majority of them happen in New York and will be filed in New York. So yeah, guys, did he has some stuff going on with his case. He has some minors at the time that's saying that they were sexually abused by him. And this guy, attorney Busby, he said 3,000 people contacted him again. He only took 120 of their cases. So what that means to me is he's verified some stuff. He done winged out all the, you know, trying to run, run Diddy pockets. He done winged all of them out to the real deal, Holyfield. And allegedly, allegedly, there's videos of this. This is bringing back uh, Michael Jackson vibes to me because I followed that case because I was in Los Angeles. And a lot of people don't know what they found in Michael Jackson's room. Um, it just, I don't know if they wasn't following it. We didn't have social media back then, but don't want to get into that. But that's what this case is bringing back to me because there's little kids involved now. Now we know Justin Bieber, Bieber, Bieber <laughs> was with Diddy. He did a video when Bieber was a kid and said, they're going to do some butt stuff that no one knows about, need to know about where they're going to be. We also know that Diddy had guardianship over Usher when he was a minor. And then one, I saw a video with um, Diddy, Kevin Hart, and Usher recent. And Diddy is saying that Usher was as young as 10 years old when he was sleeping at his house and they were wrestling over snowflake over over cornflakes or her frosted flakes or whatever. But yeah, guys, so Diddy is in hot water. He's building another team for an appeal for the bail. First bail got denied, you know. Second appeal, the appeal bail got denied. And I don't think they're going to let Diddy out with a third appeal. He can go for it, but it's just too much coming out on him. I wanted to run this to you guys because I didn't know there was minors involved with this, but there are. And so this is going to get very juicy for Diddy. This is your girl, Tree. I'll give y'all updates as I get them. With This is another tip from Tree Tips Media, and I'm out. Smooches!